Hi there, it's Anne here on the Life LDC Knits YouTube channel. This is a channel where I uh, tend to do an awful lot of reviews on my favorite yarn company, Rowan. And this is one of the two highlights of my year when the new season starts and the, the new magazine comes out. So this is the Spring and Summer Magazine number 71. And wow, look at that cover. I just absolutely adore this. And I love that the, uh, the theme for this magazine is joy. I think Rowan, like all of us, were anticipating that spring of 2022 was going to be a new beginning. The pandemic was going to be over. We were all going to be experiencing joy. We are in a way, but other things are happening. So um, I think in a way it's even more important to recognize what brings you joy in life. So this, the concept of this magazine is totally different than, than what Rowan has done in the past. And each designer was asked about what joy actually means to them. And um, so I know I normally go through the magazines page by page, but I'm not going to in this, in this regard because each designer has their little section of, of what brings them joy. Some of them are pretty obvious like Kaif. I'm just gonna give you a quick blurb at Kaif's. Kaif's joyous color. It shows a little bit of his, um, his mood board and there's the picture of the designer and one of his uh, designs. So the whole mag is, the whole first story is like that. And I actually don't want to reveal this kind of detail because I think it's really important that as a Rowan Magazine purchaser, subscriber, you need to have a really good look at it to appreciate it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about the uh, different um, designs as I flip through, but then I'm going to superimpose on top of this video the actual pictures of the designs so that you'll get tweaks, you'll get little little uh, hints, but you won't see the whole thing. Okay, so let's let's get ready and let's go. Caterpillar patches and diamond stripe, the two designs by Cave are sort of quintessential cave exuberant use of color uh, caterpillar patches uses the intarsia technique in in striped uh, color blocks and diamond stripe uses the uh, stranded technique for this really cute uh i would say retro vest with buttons up the front. I just love that look, the look of that vest. It takes me right back to the seventies. Both of these designs are done in cotton glacé, but of course you could use another yarn if you wanted to, if you, if cotton wasn't your thing. Here are the designs by Lisa Richardson. Climb is a deep v-neck cardigan with elbow length sleeves and pockets. The front bands are picked up and knit on. It's shown here in the shade silver lining of cotton cashmere. The outdoors pullover, I just love this pullover. I love the, uh, the shades that are used in it. It's a slip stitch sequence using four shades of summer light four ply. And that is truly, uh, calls out nature, that beautiful spring green and, and the, uh, the pinks and the purples. Landscape Cardigan by Lisa is a super comfy looking, lusciously cozy looking striped cardigan, uses two shades of Summerlight four ply and two of Kid Silk Haze. The colors are marled together to create the stripe pattern. It has a deep v-neck no buttons and uh, raglan sleeve shaping. Grow is uh, also by Lisa. It's a boxy sleeveless pullover with an all over diamond cable pattern shown here in uh, natural shade creative linen.
The braid design is by Martin. It's a long length bobble cable cardigan uh, shown here in creative linen. The shade is apple. The front bands are uh, knit onto the front pieces as you go along. I love that. Um, it's an oversized fit. Looks super comfy. I love the diamond cable work on fold. This is a gorgeous summer vest knit in cotton glacé. It's shown here in Ecru. Twist is also by Martin. It has raglan sleeve shaping knit in creative uh, linen shown here in natural. It's a very lacy twisted stitch cable open work design. Perfect for the summer. Very, I would think very comfy to wear. Then comes Brandon. Brandon has done here two designs. One is a colorful intarsia cardigan, that's jolly. Mostly done in cotton glacé, uh, black is the outline of all the different 13 shades that are used for the squares. But then he did dip into Summerlight 4-ply for the shade Pinched Pink. And his other design is Dawn. It's a neat fitting pullover which uses shades of cotton glacé to create the faded stripe pattern on the body and sleeves. Arn and Carlos have created two gorgeous designs here. Scrapbook is just a dreamy cardigan. It's got a fabulous all over flower pattern uh, knit in cotton cashmere. This is one for you and Tarja lovers. Cotton cashmere is also used in the collage pullover. The uh, striped ribbed bands and an all over geometric pattern. The geometric pattern is a typical stranded pattern. You just use two shades per row and uh, the, the, the stripe bands set it off. Georgia Farrell has designed Louisa, which is a very uh, neat fitting cardigan. It's got side slits, buttons, and pockets. It's in summer light, four ply shade blossom, absolutely gorgeous summer cardigan. St. Luke's is the perfect shoulder wrap for those cool nights. It uses kid silk haze and fine lace held together. There is a slip stitch in there for a bit of texture. And lots and lots and lots is a fabulous wrap, blanket, throw, whatever you want it to be in cotton cashmere. Three different uh, square patterns are knit in the various shades of cotton cashmere. And there is also a pocket. Erica Knight, known for her classic designs and she absolutely loves the creative linen yarn. So she's done two designs here. Slow is an oversized rectangle. It uh, has a deep V-neck. The side seams are um, sewn up. Armholes are created by knitting the rib on the openings. Very simple design to knit, totally elegant, perfect for the summer. Comfort is a raglan sleeved pullover. It has an A-line body and an off-center neck slit, shown here in natural creative linen. You'll see that there's a pattern that runs down from that off-center neck slit. Looks like the pattern's on the on the uh, sleeve also. Didn't notice that until I was recording right this this minute. Georgina Brand uses cotton cashmere in her two pullover designs. Granddad is a 
an oversized pullover it has dropped shoulders sleeves with a zipper front neckline it uses kid silk haze in the stripe section for a bit of texture seaside is a comfortable fit pullover that means just a little bit more ease than normal for comfort but not by any means an oversized fit if you know what i mean i love the design with its v-neck opening and collar it has drop shoulders and straight sleeves viva alric her designs are for the texture lover a pullover and a cardigan, both heavily textured, both in cotton cashmere. Free is a cardigan with, a, with various twisted stitch patterns and an unusual cardigan uh, front shape. It's got crossover fronts. It's shown here in the shade Stormy Sky. Gather is a, a pullover knit in the round downwards from the neckline with a heavily cabled pattern yoke, and it's shown here in the shade linen. Chloe Thurwell has an interesting inspiration for her joy, and her designs are, I, I, I love both of these designs. I don't know if it's the color. I'm really attracted to this pinky coral color this year. Susie is a chevron striped throw in the gorgeous coral family shades of cotton cashmere and agatha is a striped short sleeve pullover in the shell and beet shades of cotton glacé annika andre wolf's designs are flow color blocked triangular shawl in kid silk haze and still a simple box shaped cardigan body with a sleeve extension knit in stocking stitch with garter stitch bands in creative linen shown in the shade straw. Really love this approach of having the designers share with us what gives them joy and using that as inspiration for their designs. What do you think? I, I really, really like this. There's an article here and it's uh, called The Joy of Knitting. I really enjoyed this article. It's, uh, it, it explains what knitting does for all of us through good times and bad and how it supports us. And it's, it's definitely a good read, and it's a great article. And it is by Leslie Petrovsky, who is a knitter herself, and she is a writer. The second story in the magazine is called The Joy of Fresh Air. And I love that this they actually got to um, photograph this out and about in the wild. It actually doesn't say where it's photographed. Sometimes they, they will say where it is. But for those of us in the Northern Hemisphere, I think we are all anticipating the joy of getting out and about and enjoying some beautiful spring fresh air soon. The first design in this collection is Sunray by Annika Andre Wolch. And it is a long rectangular textured style, textured shawl, knit in the linden green shade of cotton cashmere. Lisa has designed a gorgeous crochet afghan in beautiful beachy sun uh, shades of cotton cashmere. There are five different yarn square motifs arranged in a box pattern. I really sort of love this. Georgia Farrell's design is called Wave. It's a raglan sleeve pullover. It's shown here in silver lining cotton cashmere. It has uh, an unusual rib that, that uh, the depth of the rib undulates along the bottom to create just that, a wave of texture. A 
another design by Lisa. It's called Pebble. It's an airy crochet top. It would be great to pop over your summer tank tops or dresses. It's shown here in the linen shade of cotton cashmere. Shade is another great crocheted top. I am a right. It's oversized and boxy, but does have armhole shaping. It's shown here in the ochre shade of cotton glacé. Coast is a, a nautical inspired pullover. It has eye detail at the shoulder and those classic blue and white stripes. Designed by Quail Studio in the shades paper and indigo of cotton cashmere. Planned is another uh, throw and shawl by Georgia Farrell. It's in four shades of cotton cashmere. It's uh, blocks of two colors used in garter stitch striping, and it has a statement tassels uh, accessory on each end. I love those statement tassels. Erica Knight's design Dune is a garter stitch sleeveless jacket with, with little shoulder extensions knit right on. It's knit in linen shade in, it's knit in the linen shade of cotton cashmere. It would be perfect for popping over your summer outfit when it starts to get cool at night. I also could see this with uh, shown here with the skirt, but I can see this looking great with a pair of pants and just a t-shirt underneath it. Erica also has done this design cliff, and I really love the color blocking on this. It's also garter stitch. It's a simple oversized rectangular shape that creates the look of short drop sleeves when the side sleeves are, uh, when the side seams are shown up. It's sort of upper thigh length and I love how it looked pieced together with the mismatched stripes and the beautiful beachy shades of cotton cashmere, indigo, harbor blue, seed and ecru. And last but not least is Grass. It's a pillow by Anna Hull. It's uh, also knit in cotton cashmere. Only three shades are used in this stranded uh, all over design. Silver Lining, Ecru, and Linden Green. While each row only uses two shades stranded across, that second shade changes every block to give this tweed effect. It's very effective. Looks great on that chair, doesn't it? Now, I think there's something here in Magazine 71 for everybody. There are demanding knits. There are colorful knits. There are intarsion knits. There are stranded knits. There are pretty plain knits. There's garter stitch. There's, there's shawls. There's throws. There's blankets. There's a pillow. Like, what more could you want? I think this is a super, super... Uh, collection and I think it's going to bring a lot of joy for spring summer 2022. Let me know if anything here catches your eye. Don't forget I have that uh, affiliate link below. So until next time when I will be reviewing another one of the Rowan, uh, let me see which one will I do next. Let me just pull it out. Next on my, my review uh, schedule is this one, Tea Garden by Martin Story. I'm looking forward to sharing this with you. So until next time, happy knitting, stay safe. I hope your knitting brings you joy. <laughs>